Hi friends, today we are going to see how to apply character ranking technique in social science research. This is the technique introduced by the Kendrew Carrot. <coughs> he is an educational psychologist. This concept is how to convert the ranks into scores. The number of items it is applied where number of item is ranked by different respondents differently. We can apply to study the reason or motivation, the like preferring different banking sector, finding low productivity in manufacturing firms, to study the reason for poor sales, what are the reason for underutilization of capacity and uh, the problems later, what are the problems faced by the bankers in collecting loans, the problems faced by the farmers in raising loans, and what are the problems in marketing of products, what are the problems in selection of mode of transport, etc. The number of reasons or problems may be more than 6 and uh, less than 10. It is good for this technique. Let us go by this questionnaire. The factors motivating customers to avail e banking services. We ask the respondent to rank the following in the order of importance. Because we have given there are 10 different aspects of e banking services. The factor 1 is no time pump. No need of customer presence in the bank. Time saving. Factor 4 easy transfer. Factor 5 trustworthy and confidential. Factor 6 all kind of transactions from our desk. Factor 7 availability of account details. Factor 8 easy mobile banking even without cellular network. So these are the different aspects of e banking services. We ask the respondent to rank it. What is the formula? The carrot mean score. We are going to find out the carrot mean score. That is the sigma GP RF divided by N, where G is a carrot score corresponding to the present position that is denoted by P. P present position is equal to this is a formula given by a carrot. 100 the value is constant 100 into rank given to the ith factor by jth individual minus 0 0.5 0 0.5 is a constant 100 and 0 0.5 is constant it is used in all the time divided by number of factors ranked by jth individual rf means rank wise frequency n stands for number of respondents what are the steps to be followed. First we have to collect the data. See in this example I have collected data from 165 respondent and entered into the spreadsheet. 